Sports Illustrated released its projected medal count for the upcoming Summer Olympics. A potential golden harvest awaits Team South Korea, and that's adding some extra excitement to the global games. But with just three days to go, there are lingering questions about whether Brazil will ever be ready to play proper host in time. Yoon Shin has the latest buzz surrounding the Rio Olympics. Team Korea is on track to reach its goal of bringing home 10 gold medals for a top 10 finish at this year's Rio Olympics, if the predictions by an acclaimed American sports magazine come true. Sports Illustrated has released its medal predictions for all 196 countries in all 306 events. Korea is expected to grab 10 gold, 11 silver and 10 bronze medals for a ninth place finish overall. The magazine predicts Korea will continue its winning streak in archery with gold and silver in both the men's and women's events and gold in the team competition. The country is also expected to pick up a smattering of medals in judo, badminton and taekwondo, but no gold for the athletes practicing Korea's traditional martial art. The magazine projects the United States and China will take home the biggest medal haul this year with 45 golds each. More than half a million sports fans are descending on Brazil as we speak, giving the country's embattled economy a much-needed boost. But amid the excitement, there are still lingering concerns about the host city's new subway line, which was initiated to shuttle visitors from all over the world to Olympic events. It's one of the main legacy projects of the Games, but it's reportedly still not complete. Fleets of buses have been organized as a backup transportation mode. The delay is just one of a long list of problems for Brazil ahead of the main event, which is scheduled for 8 p.m. on Friday with more than 10,000 participating athletes. In honor of the birthplace of the Games, Greece will be first in the parade of nations that kicks things off, followed by other countries in order according to the Brazilian Portuguese alphabet, which makes South Korea 52nd. The question is, though, will they be ready? Yunshin, Arirang News.